geothermal energy's low tariffs make it competitive in the energy market, and this resource makes Kenya an attractive investment hotspot. The Cabinet Secretary for Energy and Petroleum, Mr. Davis Churchill, expressed that this resource is significant in lowering the cost of power in Kenya. He announced the government's plan to invite investors to convert the steam into affordable electricity by the end of the year. In Minengai today, where we have seen 35 megawatts uh, discharging to the grid for the first time from today, they are dispatching at 6.5, 6.9 cents US. So don't forget that we sell power to the, our homes at about 20 cents US. If we develop power at 6 cents, we can see the cost of energy in Kenya coming down significantly. Kenya Power has reported an increase in electricity uptake from thermal energy plants. The geothermal development company projects the Parker field to generate 100 megawatts by 2030, which aligns with Kenya's commitment to green energy and lowering power costs. We are working with partners from the private sector to convert that power at night to green hydrogen, to ammonia, which we can take as a country because we are an agricultural economy. This region is far flung from the county and it's one of people will call it a neglected region. But we thank GDC for what they have done, for opening up the area through roads, infrastructure development in terms of education and the support. Kenya Electricity Transmission Company is also preparing to set up a transmission line to transmit electricity from power plants at Parker Hills to western Kenya with completion expected by 2026. We are currently coming to the tail end and we hope by December we'll have financial closure so that we spend the next two years uh, in uh, constructing the line. We have energy security moving forward. In addition to Parker Hills, GDC is also developing other geothermal fields in various counties, including Silali and Korosi in Baringo County and Suswa in Narok and Kajiado counties. Globlek Limited, another independent power producer, is set to start power plant construction in Menengai later this year. Ben Kirera, K24, Nairobi.